for today's craft, we are going to be making a bouquet of hand print tulips in honor of Mother's Day. So what you're going to need um, are some pipe cleaner, pencil, construction paper, tape, and some string to tie your bouquet together. So let's go ahead and get started. First thing you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna trace your hands out. Go ahead and do three um, for the bouquet. So let's go ahead and forgot to mention earlier, but you will need some scissors. So let's go ahead and cut out our handprints. For the next step, um, if you have any pencil lines on your handprint, you can go ahead and erase those. The next step we are going to do, we are going to make the stem of our flowers. You're gonna need the pipe cleaners. Um, I already have half of a yellow one from when I did the project before. So you're gonna to wanna to cut the yellow one in half. There you go, three of those. So you, if you want to, you can cut the green ones in half if you want. I. The one thing I don't like about pipe cleaners is that they're sharp on the end. So what I'm actually gonna do is I'm gonna fold it in half like that. And then the part that's open right here, you're going to wanna make that into a hook, just like that, okay? And then you're going to take the yellow one and you're gonna put it in the hook like that and then bring it up so it should look like that. As you can see, by folding it in half, it's not sharp down here. So next, what you're going to do is you're going to take one of the yellow sides and you're gonna pull it down like that, okay? And then you're gonna take this piece and you're just going to wrap it around. Just like that. You're gonna to wanna to do that to the other two. So we'll go ahead and do that again here. Now we are going to take our hand prints and what you're going to do is you're going to fold it over and connect it just like that. Try to leave a little bit of a gap here um, so you can put your stems through. Um, doesn't have to be too big, so something like that. And go ahead and tape those up. Now go ahead and take your pencil that you had earlier and you're going to use that to create the petals. So what you're going to do is you're going to take it and you're just going to roll it down like that. So go ahead and do that for all of them. So let's go ahead and piece together our flowers here. Go ahead and right there. Okay. You don't have to pull it all the way down. Okay. 
if you doubled yours over like I did, you might have a little hard time uh, sticking them in there. So let's go ahead and finish this up by tying a nice little bow around our bouquet here. All right, and there you go. Bouquet of flowers for Mother's Day.